In the health sector, the infectious disease hospital housed in the former Ocean View International Hotel will soon be operational. This is according to the Chief Medical Officer, Dr. Shamdeo Persaud, who was a part of a team that inspected the ongoing works at the facility on Monday. The establishment of the facility stemmed from recommendations by international healthcare partner PAHO WHO, which had suggested that countries ensure that there is capacity at all levels to isolate, treat and manage a high rise of coronavirus cases. After the walkthrough, Dr. Passad noted that the hospital is much closer to becoming a center of excellence as it will serve its purpose during the COVID-19 pandemic and even after. The progress of the work has been uh, commendable, to say the least. Uh, you know, they've transformed the facility from what it was to where it is now. I think the quality of the work so far from um, the initial inspection seems to be um, up to date. Uh, like with every medical facility, we'll have to cater for special services. There is a space for the operating room, there's space for a kitchen, laundry, um, you know, waste management, um, uh, area for the provision of all of the necessary gases, including oxygen, uh, the other kinds of the pharmacy, laboratory, and so on. The CMO also noted that this facility will have a role post-COVID as it could be used to house complex tuberculosis and other severe acute respiratory infection cases. Meanwhile, the architectural consultant, Orin Boyce of Aquason Designs Incorporated, said the design is in keeping with international standards. The facility is bussing. It is divided into eight, eight lots. Um, namely, we have uh, Ms. Ivor Allen. Mr. Javman, Mr. Nicholson, and some other small contractors. And overall, I must say, a facility originally like this would normally take six months. And for us to bring it in a little over three months is it's, it's monumental. And that, come about, that comes about because of the collective and working with the doctors and the medical team and Ministry of Health. According to public health ministry engineers, Infrastructural costs for the new infectious diseases hospital is approximately 1.1 billion Guyana dollars. For Info Hub, Delicia Haynes.